So it's time for Dexter to go to bed because we are going to get up bright and early and we're leaving at 4 a.m. and headed to Carmel, Indiana. So we'll see you there. So we arrived at Indie Coffee Roasters and we are going to hop on inside and grab some goodies to go. So we'll see you inside. So we got some scones and muffins and hot tea, coffee, cappuccino, all to go. The outside patio is closed right now. They're going to open it up on Sunday, but we wanted to get our nice hot drinks today. So we're taking it to go. So Dexter's enjoying snooping around, stretching his legs. It's been a, about four hours in the car, so he's ready to stretch and walk around and evidently eat some grass. And they have nice poopy stations all over the place. A nice covered spot that we're gonna head over to and have our coffee and eat our snacks. All right, you ready to eat our snacks? Not the grass snacks? <laughs> All right, so time to check out this muffin. I can tell you it's definitely moist. And sadly, this boy thinks it's for him, but I would say no. Yep, super moist, very tasty. Definitely a do-over. So they do have Central Bark Park, and we'll take a peek at that. They have a small dog area, and they also do have a large dog area, which is currently closed because of the conditions, I'm guessing maybe the rain and stuff. It's a pretty decent size area. I think there, we saw some dogs in the back. I think there might be some different entrances as well. So I'll have the link, of course, in the blog so you can check it out. We have a nice covered area. We've got poop stations in there. Actually quite a few poop stations. So we're at Central Park in Carmel and we're gonna go take a stroll and enjoy the morning. So they have the Monon Community Center. It's part of the park. And this is really large. Let's see what we do. And we're just gonna get our start. And let's see if I can zoom over here. See that little kid? <laughs> He's got a skate park in there too. And then a water park. And a nice paved trail. So they have a huge water park. If I had this when I was younger, I would have had so much fun because I went to our public pool twice a day. The kids here are super lucky. Oh, right in the mud, Dexter. <laughs> so he's on a roll. <laughs> he's very frisky. Very frisky today. And it's a grow, don't mow, which is very nice. It keeps everything lush and natural. Hence all the birds. So there's our red-winged black bird. Can we see him? He came down and landed in front of us. So a great sign, nesting birds of the rookery. And we can zoom in here. Great blue heron. Night heron. Ooh, an egret. Osprey. Hawk. 
It looks like there's nests. Take a look, listen closely, walk slowly, and use quiet voices. You may spot a hawk way up in the trees or hear the lovely sounds of a songbird. Even in the middle of a city, you can see and enjoy wildlife. Can you see him? Really digging in there. Must be fishing something, his little slippers are just moving. His head's dark too, he must be going right in the mud. So we are at our next adventure, and that is Modern Trail. We have lots of spots to walk. And we were at the 96th Street location and super happy that they do have public restrooms. Dexter's enjoying a good lick. He's really getting into it. He actually just had his water from inside the car too. <laughs> you work up a thirst having snacks. So Dexter is taking a stroller ride, a little rest, which is one of the reasons why I love Paige Paz. Makes it so nice, so when Dexter needs to have a rest, we can still take our adventure. All right, so this whole bike pack is part of the old Monon Railroad, and as you can see, they have the abandoned uh, posts that held the telegraph lines that went along the railroad. So there's a lot of, a lot of, if you're a railroader, a lot of railroad history here, looking through the Monon Railroad. So we are at Clay Terrace, and we're gonna do a little snooping around, and we're gonna get some lunch first. And there's lots of things here, lots of shops, and I was told that some of them are dog friendly as well. And if you can see, they actually have a dog park. So we'll go check that out too. So we're heading to Pies and Pints for some lunch. And we're going to eat it in the covered patio. So we'll see you inside. And they even serve indie coffee. So they brought Dexter a big drink of water. And <laughs> he is going at it. <laughs> Blacks all the wind. He's still drinking. He was a thirsty puppy. Yes, you were a thirsty puppy. So, mom got the Cuban pulled pork. Oh, look at that. I got the garden grinder. We're heading to Orvis. Dogs welcome. So we'll let the chatterbox go in. <laughs> Always a fun time in these stores. Yeah, I already lost my stepdad. He went flying in. <laughs> Does like to fish. Yeah. <laughs> Terrace Dog Park. I'm not sure how many shopping centers I've ever seen that have their own dog park. Actually, I'd probably say zero. So, let's go take a peek. So, Clay Terrace has a nice little dog park here, too, for residents and visitors. Because it had uh, free access to get in. So, that's always nice, especially when traveling. You're able to get out there and let them romp a little bit. Burn off some energy. Granted, uh, there's been a lot of rain. Everything's a little flooded right now. It's got some poopy bags. Do you see that down there? They got lots of tennis balls. How cute is that? All right, so we're at the Old Town Caramel Bed and Breakfast, and I'm going to check in. 
And this is where we get to stay for the next three days. All right, so we have a main key to get into the sitting room. It's very cute. <laughs> and some keys. I said, help yourself to the keys. And we're in room one and two. So I'm gonna guess we're upstairs. Alright, so here's our Emily Rose room. Another nice bed. Looks like a sleigh bed. Very cute. Nice little desk there. It's really TV. Beautiful lights. Loving the chairs. Closet. Adventurous. That's Dexter. Pretty blue. Like that's a nice big bed. Lots of light. Got some books over there. Oh, looks like we have a goodie bag to check out. How cute is this? Visit Hamilton County, Indiana. Welcome to Carmel. So we have some stuff. Me and Dexter. Oh, water bottle. Always nice. Poop bags. Water. Uh-oh. Do I see something? Oh boy. Birthday cake treats. Dexter, Dexter, Dexter. I like that. Some local honey. Oh, that's always good. We like honey. Sunlight cream ale. Ooh, yummy. You hear Dexter snorting over there? He thinks that we have treats. Lisa's pie shop. Strawberry rhubarb. Ooh. A t shirt. Nice. And Dexter. Dexter here knows we have a snack for him, so let's go ahead and give him one. Alright. Do you think you deserve this, Dexter? I don't know. What do you think? <laughs> you always gotta lay down and eat it. Substantial. Maybe we'll give him another one. You want, <laughs> you want another one, Dexter? Uh, yeah? Alright, who wants another birthday treat? It's not your birthday, though. Oh. <laughs> We are at Books and Brews, and we're going to grab something to eat. Look at what they have. Paint your pet party. How cute is that? I have not painted Dexter. I have no talent when it comes to drawing and painting, but we have some outside seating, and my favorite thing is that it is fully covered, and it's actually enclosed. Um, between buildings so blocks off the wind and there is Eddie and grandma inside placing their order we're just gonna take turns and let's take a look over here definitely got some brews there and the menu looked pretty darn good and so Dexter and I are just gonna hang out and we will see what his mommy orders Pizza. Yeah, look at that. Mm -hmm. Got meat on it? It's got pulled pork and it's on non bread. Mm. <laughs> it's so good. So we had a great day here in Carmel, Indiana, and it's time for Dexter to go to bed. So we will see you tomorrow.
<laughs> so we have this little center area. Get some tables out, very welcoming. Some businesses, looks like some apartments. Dexter's enjoying his day, he's checking things out. <laughs> Whoa, there we go. <laughs> and there's lots of things going on. Isn't he cute? <laughs> Sculptures. They're a little... They're just so realistic. Look at that. The texture even thinks it's somebody real. It's crazy. Alright, so we're at Dantello's Italian restaurant. And we're gonna grab some dinner. And it has lots of nice outdoor seating and some umbrellas that are staying up. We weren't sure because of the wind. We had a little bit of wind. We're gonna have to have Dexter lie down because he's being a little stinker. Lots of tables. It's a perfect day for outside eating. Alright, so Dexter is settling in and we placed our order and we are excited to try it. It sounds good. Just wait until you see what we got. So mom got the beef ravioli. So that looks pretty good. So I got the ravioli special. Oh, that's a good ravioli show. Have you tried it? And this looks really good. You can hear Dexter talking in the background. So Ed got veal parmesan. He's gonna dig in there. Looks good. So we had a really great weekend here in Carmel, Indiana. And Dexter should be pretty tired. But I think he's getting a second wind. But we will see you next time on the vlog. And remember to pause and enjoy life. See you next week. Mm -hmm.